So good morning, everybody. Yeah, we got a crazy day here at the Easton household. <laughs> yeah, uh, so they're replacing our roof. This was from a windstorm that we had in March. And yeah, snow is not the ideal time to be starting a roof, but that's what happens when your insurance company just keeps screwing you and screwing you and screwing you until finally they agree to replace the roof. So they're gonna be making a bunch of noise at the house. So I'm gonna make my own noise down here and get to doing some firewood. Check out this dump trailer. This mini dump is so cool. They can drive it wherever they want, fill it up, and then take it and dump it over where they need to dump it into a bigger trailer. It's pretty amazing. That's pretty slick. Yeah, I thought I'd show you a little bit of that. That was kind of cool. Yeah. Oh, those guys are crazy. Just, just crazy. I don't see this very often. It's actually quite a bit quieter down here in the barns than it is at the house right now. I just feel the need to make a quick mention all the work I did this summer on these barns, getting these walls up and everything. It is cold out here and windy and snowy, but I walk in here and I mean, it's instant. There's no wind, it's quiet. This is a very, very nice place to work. the electric do it. Ain't gonna lie, that's a lot of wood for this thing. Got a rack cut, now I can split it. I like to do that. It's nice to break things up a little bit. Speaking of breaking things up, this wall is doing a great job of breaking the wind. I love it. Those poor roofers, oh my gosh, they're up there and all this. It's not our fault. We did not wait until December to get our roof done. It was the insurance company. I don't want to name names, but uh, they were not like a good neighbor, if you know what I mean. Really, really upsetting with what we had to go through after they denied and denied, you know. Oh. And then finally, I mean, we, it was 60 mile per hour winds in, in March, ripped tons of shingles off. It needed to be replaced. The whole roof had to be done. They knew it. It's just what you gotta do nowadays. Anyway, enough of that. Let's get some splitting done.
So the best part about this situation today for me is that all of this is spoken for. I've got three cords sitting here, one for my brother and two for my friend. This is all gonna be sold in the fall of 2024, okay? Ready to be seasoned and it's good to go. Every stick that I put here, starting from here on, is extra. It's not spoken for. It hasn't been sold yet. So this, this means extra money in my book. That's what it means to me. And uh, it's kind of exciting. This is the beginning of the growth. One cord for my brother. One cord for my friend, another cord for my friend, that takes care of him. And this, this is growth. Yeah, yeah, that means that I don't feel as much pressure. That's, that's honestly what it feels like, you know? I did this because I enjoy it. I do this and I don't want to make it so I don't enjoy it, you understand? So this is good, the pressure's off, but I'm still gonna go make more. <laughs> So this here is the last of that maple tree, that storm damage that I, I got paid to, to take care of. I didn't shoot video of it because I was getting paid to do it, but this is the last of that tree, which also is the last of the wood that is outside the barns. Everything else is stacked over here. So this is good because that means for the rest of the winter, I can stay inside. Oh yeah, things are really coming along today. So this is the area where I store my bulk firewood. This is the stuff that goes to my dad and it's all cleaned out and ready now. So I can start dumping his stuff in this corner. It'll only stay here as long as it needs to until I can stack it at his house next summer. And that there is what you call a good start. <laughs> this feels so good. This is the beginning right here. That's all you got to do. You just got to get started. You just keep keep pounding away. It's going to happen. Things will happen. Yeah. This is like a $300 per cord savings account. That's what this is. And every piece that I put on here adds to it. Yeah. It's good. It's good. Things are going to be good. I'm going to... There's always wood out there. I'm going to find it. So... It'll be fun to see where this all goes, see what kind of challenges I face, and see what kind of successes I do. So, hey, I appreciate you being here. Hope you hit that thumbs up and uh, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you next time when I'm doing more stuff. See you then.